The automotive world is abuzz with a bold announcement from Koji Sato, the CEO of Toyota that has ignited a heated debate within the industry. The announcement challenges the surging wave of electric vehicles about an unconventional technology, that is, an ammonia engine. As the electric vehicle landscape continues to evolve and reshape the way we perceive transportation, Toyota's audacious claim of their new ammonia engine potentially overturning the entire EV industry demands closer examination. Could this innovation truly pose a formidable challenge to the dominance of electric vehicles or is it a strategic maneuver to secure a distinct position in the competitive automotive realm? Stay tuned as we take a look at the possible consequences of this ammonia industry and how Toyota may change the entire EV industry. So what is an ammonia engine? The ammonia engine is a departure from the traditional reliance on fossil fuels, or even the electric powertrains that have dominated recent discussions. Instead, it leverages the chemical properties of ammonia, a compound composed of nitrogen and hydrogen to generate power. This unconventional choice stems from the desire to create a viable alternative to the existing paradigms while also addressing concerns related to energy efficiency and emissions. At its core, the ammonia engine operates through a combustion process that takes place within the engine cylinders. Ammonia, which is stored in the vehicle's fuel tank, is introduced into the engine's combustion chamber. Here, it is mixed with air and then ignited by a spark plug. The combustion of ammonia produces a high-pressure gas mixture that expands, driving the pistons and generating mechanical energy. This energy is then harnessed to power the vehicle's wheels and drive it forward. The key to the ammonia engine's functionality lies in its ability to extract energy from the chemical reaction between ammonia and oxygen. This reaction releases heat, which when harnessed can be converted into mechanical work. The ammonia engine's operation involves a carefully controlled combustion process that optimizes energy conversion and minimizes harmful emissions. This innovative approach challenges conventional notions of internal combustion engines and showcases Toyota's commitment to pushing the boundaries of automotive technology. The development of the ammonia engine underscores Toyota's dedication to sustainability and its relentless pursuit of more environmentally friendly transportation solutions. By embracing an alternative fuel source like ammonia, Toyota aims to reduce its reliance on traditional fossil fuels and pave the way for a cleaner, more sustainable future in the automotive industry. As the ammonia engine continues to be refined and tested, its potential to reshape the landscape of transportation remains an intriguing prospect that could herald a new era of propulsion technology. There are various advantages of an ammonia engine. First are the reduced emissions. One of the significant advantages of ammonia engines is their potential to reduce emissions compared to traditional internal combustion engines significantly. Ammonia combustion primarily produces nitrogen and water as byproducts, minimizing the release of harmful pollutants such as carbon dioxide and particulate matter. Next is the fuel availability. Ammonia is abundant and can be produced from renewable sources, such as hydrogen derived from the electrolysis of water, using renewable energy sources like solar or wind power. This makes ammonia a potentially sustainable fuel option, reducing dependence on fossil fuels. Ammonia also has a high energy density, meaning it can store a considerable amount of energy in a compact volume. This is crucial for vehicle's range and performance as a smaller amount of fuel can provide a longer driving distance. Another added advantage is the compatibility with existing infrastructure. Ammonia engines can potentially leverage existing internal combustion engine infrastructure, such as refueling stations and supply chains. This could facilitate a smoother transition to alternate propulsion systems without requiring a complete overhaul of the infrastructure. On top of these, ammonia also has hybrid applications. Ammonia engines can be integrated into hybrid systems, combining their benefits with electric powertrains. This hybridization could further enhance efficiency and reduce overall emissions. Just as a coin has two sides, ammonia engine also has its disadvantages. While ammonia combustion produces fewer carbon emissions, it can still lead to the formation of nitrogen oxides, or NOx, under certain conditions. NOx is a contributor to air pollution and can have negative effects on both air quality and human health. 
Another drawback of the ammonia engine is the energy-intensive production. The production of ammonia requires energy, often derived from fossil fuels. If renewable energy sources are not used for ammonia production, the overall environmental benefits of the technology might be compromised. Ammonia is toxic and poses handling and storage challenges. It requires specialized infrastructure to ensure safe transport and storage, which could add complexities to its widespread adoption. Also, achieving efficient and complete combustion of ammonia in an engine can be challenging. Unburned ammonia can lead to engine inefficiencies, reduced performance, and potentially harmful emissions. Acknowledging the promising possibilities, Toyota has forged a partnership with the Chinese state-owned manufacturer GAC. Together, they have unveiled a prototype engine engineered to effectively burn liquid ammonia, demonstrating a remarkable emission reduction of approximately 90%. Ammonia possesses a unique capability to transport hydrogen more efficiently than hydrogen itself. Its liquid state at ambient temperatures eliminates the need for energy-intensive compression or cryogenic liquefaction equipment, making it a more manageable alternative. While some projects focus on converting ammonia back into hydrogen via cracking and employing fuel cells for electric power, others opt for modified combustion engines, which is the subject of our discussion today. During a recent Tech Day presentation, Toyota and Gyeongzhou Automotive Group Co., or GAC, unveiled a pioneering achievement, a 2.0-liter engine adept at safely and efficiently combusting liquid ammonia. Reports from Bloomberg indicate the engine boasts a peak power output of 120 kilowatts or 161 horsepower and a remarkable 90% reduction in carbon emissions compared to conventional fuels. Exploring ammonia-powered engines isn't an entirely new concept. Around a decade ago, researchers at the Korean Institute for Energy Research introduced the AMVA, a vehicle that blended 70% ammonia with 30% gasoline. This innovative approach led to a significant 70% reduction in carbon emissions. The AMVA project demonstrated the potential of a fully ammonia-fueled engine. Despite Toyota and GAC's notable achievements, there are certain challenges that demand attention on the path to integrating ammonia engines into the automotive landscape. The absence of a comprehensive refueling infrastructure poses a significant hurdle. Additionally, the developed ammonia engine is prone to generating high levels of nitrogen oxide emissions, with potential issues related to unburned ammonia exiting the tailpipe particularly in compression-style engines, similar to diesel. Furthermore, the production of ammonia using the Harbor-Bosch process raises concerns about emissions associated with its manufacturing. This implies the potential inclusion of another fuel component integrated into the engine's architecture. This strategy could prove logical, given that ammonia's properties, including its slow flame propagation rate, can present difficulties for engines functioning at high RPMs or lower engine loads. The amalgamation of ammonia with an alternate fuel may have allowed the engine to reduce these constraints, facilitating more seamless performance across diverse driving scenarios. Should GAC and Toyota aim to introduce ammonia-powered engines to the automotive sector, they are undoubtedly set to confront numerous obstacles along the way. While Toyota and GAC's progress is encouraging, these hurdles highlight the need for further research and innovation to unlock the full potential of ammonia-powered engines. As the automotive industry continues to explore sustainable alternatives, overcoming these challenges could pave the way for a greener future in transportation. So what do you think about this new ammonia engine? Will it be able to revolutionize the entire EV industry? Let us know in the comments below! And if you like this video, be sure to like it and subscribe to our channel for more exciting news like this!